In this video, I'm going to talk about how to estimate population sizes with the capture mark recapture technique. So one way that biologists estimate population sizes is with this capture mark recapture method. So we have three different variables in this method for estimating population size. The first is represented by the letter M, and those are marked individuals that are captured on the first day, marked with some kind of marking to show that they've been captured, and then released. We then go back out some day later, and we capture a bunch more individuals, and the number of those individuals that we capture on the second day is represented by the letter C. Um, and those that of those that have marks on them from the previous sampling are noted as recaptures and represented with the letter R. So to estimate the population size, we use the Lincoln-Peterson index, which is represented with the following formula. N, which is the estimated population size, equals C divided by R times M. Okay, so let's walk through an example. So let's assume you're a graduate student interested in painted turtles, and you need to estimate the popula population size of painted turtles in Cachawanooka Lake. On the first day, you and your team of volunteers capture 24 turtles. You put a small spot of paint on each turtle's shell, and you release each turtle back to the lake where you caught it. Three days later, you return and you capture 15 turtles that have that marking on it and an additional 37 turtles that don't have any marking on it. So from that, you should be able to calculate the estimated population size of painted turtles in the lake. So let's walk through the solution. So you want to calculate this population size, n, of the painted turtles. And so remember that n equals c divided by r times m. So from that word problem, you need to extract these variables. So remember that c represents the number of captured turtles on the second sampling day, whatever day that is. So in this case, you were given the number of marked individuals and the number of unmarked individuals. So you have to add those together to get c. So you got 52 turtles on the second sampling day. m is the original marked, captured, marked, and released individuals, and that was 24. And the recaptures on the second day, those turtles that were caught that had that spot of paint on their shell is 15. So we just take those numbers and put it into the formula and we get n equals 52 divided by 15 times 24 which equals 83.2 and then we always want to have a concluding statement so that it's very clear um, the answer that you're giving so we say that the estimated population size of painted turtles in the marshland or in the lake or whatever area you happen to be sampling is 83.